So I ain't never made a video before, but I'm gonna teach you how to take a flat crown cowboy hat with a cattleman crown. And I, I did do that myself. Um, I'm gonna teach you how to take this and shape it in the exact hat that I'm wearing right now. So we're gonna do it with just a regular iron. Um, I would advise that you use a steamer, but here we go. We're gonna heat up the, the top of the brim of the hat. And what we're gonna do is uh, begin the bend. We're not gonna make the whole bend at first. And I'll take it nice and slow. I'll steam that hat real good. And I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna crease it. About yay right there. So that would be one side. We're gonna make kind of a cutter looking hat right now. So now we got one side established. So I'm just kind of gonna split the difference. I'm gonna make the other bend about right there. So I'll keep my finger right there and try not to get burnt. Again, I'm gonna steam the top of the brim. Steam right up real good. I'm gonna take that and just kind of flip him up. I'll crease it real good right there. Just kind of pinch it between your index finger and your thumb. And just kind of keep stroking it back with your, with your other hand, kind of like so. And I'll give it a nice gentle Crease to it. Nice gentle, nice gentle curve is what you want. That's the back profile of the hat. And you can see that this side right here needs to come up a little bit. So all we need to do is I'll steam the bottom of that right there. Right on the bend line is where you want to steam it. Pop him up a little bit further. Something like that. So now that's the back view of the hat. There's your front view. Well, pretty daggone even right there, just like that. So now what we want to do is you can see that this flat, this hat has a real flat profile. We want to add a little curvature to it like this. So what we're going to do is heat up the hat right there, right along this seam. And we're going to just gently take our hand and press down this way. So I'll demonstrate that right now. Remember, we just made these seams, these two right here, so these two creases, so we don't want to jack those up. We just want to gently take that, that front and kind of cusp it down a little bit. Now you can see bend is a is a little uneven that's because i got the i got the felt a little too warm that's one of those bends that you do not want to get the felt very hot you want it you want to just steam it just enough to move it but not too much that right there will probably be just enough
Now you can see we got a got a, just a tad bit of downturn on that hat. And a lot of people like that hat, just to, just pretty well straight across from the back of the the back of the sweatband to the back. They want that a little bit. They want that straight. I personally like a little bit of bend to it, so that's what we're going to do. So I'm going to add just a just a hair bend to it. Again, I'm going to heat it up real close to the hat band. A lot of folks say that that's not a good idea. I found that it doesn't hurt it. Another thing you can do is stick it on the countertop. Place your hand right across as flat as you can. Again, that bend may not be completely perfect at first. But that is damn close. So now you can see that whenever I take this hat off and put this one on, it is very, very close to the same profile. And that is with a little old steam iron. Thanks for watching.